It's time for the One Bar and Lepica Show, bringing you anything and everything Minnesota Vikings. Welcome to professional football. All right. Welcome back to the One Bar and Lepica Show. I'm One Bar, and it is a good, good Saturday morning. Got a cup of coffee. Sun is shining. It is not a great Saturday morning for Kentrell Brothers. Kentrell Brothers, who is still looking to hope to get a sniff from a team before the season start, is officially suspended for the first nine games of the 2020 season. Um, this is not new territory for him. Back in 2018, he was suspended for the first four games, violating the performance-enhancing drugs policy and this probably is the same thing I don't think they flat out come out and said it but uh yeah Kentrell Brothers still a free agent um will not be able to play in the first nine games if he gets signed obviously he's suspended for those games if he does not get signed and is a free agent those games count towards it so someone could actually sign him week 10 and he could play right off the bat um Kentrell Brothers has always offered special teams depth for the Vikings we got him back in round five I believe from Missouri um I actually had higher hopes for him that he was going to add some decent depth and even possibly push for some uh, playing time on defense, but that never really happened, but he did offer some good special teams. Um, Brothers. I looked at, even though he was still a free agent as a guy that the Vikings could possibly bring back into the mix throughout the season, whether there's an injury, uh, we lost a handful of guys that we loved on special teams. Um, Maybe we needed to bring him back to help shore that up, but, he, he seemed like a guy, like a Marcus Sherrill's type guy, where he's just always there in case you want to bring him back. So that is not going to be the case, at least for the first nine weeks. We will see what happens after that. But Kentrell Brothers, I uh, always have extra, extra love for him. Back in training camp a handful of years ago, I was that guy in the stands who may have had a beer or two too many and yelled to him that I loved him. He turned around and he said, I love you too. So from that moment on, Kentrell Brothers is my guy. I hope he does get another shot, but this is not going to help his case. We will check back week 10 to see if anybody, including the Vikings, is sniffing around Kentrell Brothers.